there my gorgeous people how are you hope you're keeping safe and doing great it's your girl here jay mccory thank you so much for subscribing to my channel you guys are so amazing i love you so much if you're new here and if you're not subscribed please subscribe so for today's video like uh, how you've requested me in the comment section i always do what you want me to do i serve you what you want i love you so much and i'll always do what you tell me to do i'll do that because the love i have for you guys it's so much so for today what i'm going to show it's a beginner friendly eyeshadow tutorial and uh, it's a smoky purple tutorial actually it's a very beginner friendly thing like um it's what i've done today like how i got that smoky purple eye look stay tuned and um if you've not subscribed please subscribe hit that subscription button turn the notification bell on by ringing that bell there so that you'll be notified each time i post a new video so without going into much details let's jump into the video i'll start by comping my eyebrows then i go on with that davis number three sharp eye pencil so I just line and then after lining you know I just fill in The next I'm going to line my eyebrows using an LA Pro Concealer in the shade Pure Beige. you if you're concealing your upper side of your brows use the a concealer or a foundation the same one you're using for your you know for your face so that gives you easy time to blend in Then I just go blending in with a small fluffy brush. So next I'm going to conceal my eyelids and I'm using an LA Pro Concealer concealer in the shade Pure Beige. I'm just using a small fluffy brush to do that. Then after concealing, I immediately set in the concealer to avoid creasing. And for this case, I'm using my um, face powder and it's a banana J cut. And next, we're going to the eyeshadow. But before going to the eyeshadow, because this video is a uh, beginner friendly, if you're a beginner, please, please uh, don't skip this step. Uh. Take your cellar tape uh, and put it on your hand, like uh, just to remove the excess, uh, you know, the excess stickiness. Uh. So just do that on your skin until the excess excess glue or stickiness uh, reduces. Just do that. And then put it uh, there like this one really guides you if you are a beginner
I'm telling you guys, this selector really works magic, huh? And then I'll go with my uh, Slick Eyeshadow Palette, number 570. And then I'll take the black shade, that one. So then I'll just do in the outer corner of my eyelids. Like, I'm trying to form a little V, you know. And when you're doing your eyeshadow, you know, tap in and blend with a circular motion by that i mean you know just tap in your um, like tap in your eye tap in your brush the <laughs> eyeshadow like that then tap in there on your eye and then blend using the circular motion The next, I'm going to blend the black part. Like, I just want to blend to avoid the harsh, you know, the harsh look. And I'm using this, um, this brown shade. That one. This one. From the LA After Party eyeshadow palette. Then I'll go with the first transition color I used, which was the black uh, eyeshadow. Uh, I'll just take the brush. I've not uh, used any new product here. Like uh, the product that I used before is still on the brush. So I'll just go and blend everything in. Then I'll go on with the second uh, brush I use for the second transition color and again just blend that area in I remember when you're blending you know don't just go you know like uh, rubbing from one end to another use circular motion and then for this crease area I'll go back to my slick eyeshadow palette and go for this purple shade that one Then, you know, I just tap in on that crease area. Next, I'm going uh, to the LA After Color Party and I'm going for this shimmer, purple shimmer shade. So I'm using the exact concealer brush I used to doing my eyebrows. It has product, like I've not used any new product. So I'm just using the brush and I'm tapping in in the palette. And again, just tap in on that crease area. By using the concealer brush, it's so easy, like it uh, helps, 
it gives you that exact uh, color for the eyeshadow and then after doing that i'll go back to my second transition shade which was a brown and i just blend again that part Then next I'll go for my black uh, color and you know just blend everything in. So I'm just blending everything in. I'm concentrating on that part that had created a V. Again, just blend with the second transition color. <laughs> I know it looks weird at this particular time, but still on that progress. So next, I'm going to use an eyeliner. Like I'm going to line my eyes in preparation to fix my falsies, and I'm using the Floma eyeliner pen. It looks like that. Next, I'm going to mascara and I'm using the Maybelline Rocket Volume Express. I'm fixing my falsies. So next I'm just removing the sellotape and you be careful on doing this and be so gentle. Look at that. That's where the secret lies. Huh? Look at that. So let me do my foundation and my, you know, let me do my face actually off camera and then I'll be back to finish this. So I didn't want this to make this video long and uh, I did the entire look like I've said off camera and here I am. So I want to smoke my under eyes and I'll do that using the black color from the sleek uh, eyeshadow palette. So I'll just use the black one.
have parts of her. It looks good, right? So next I'm going to the LA After Party eyeshadow palette and I'm going for that purple. I'm just still smoking my under eye. Look at that, guys. Okay, it's the tears for me. Don't count my tears. I love that. So, next, I'm just going to mascara and I'm still doing my down lashes. I love that look. Okay, usually when I'm doing my uh, down lashes with mascara, I don't go with a mascara brush like that. Like, you know, I just pull, pull out. I don't know if you're seeing that, like I just pull out like that. When you're doing this, you have to be so careful uh, so that you don't hurt your eyes. Huh? So let me just concentrate. Huh? You see how I'm pulling the down lashes and mascara. So there I am with my purple smoky eyes. I love it so far. It was so easy doing it. There we are. Look at that. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you found it helpful, Please give it a thumbs up. Let me know in the comment section what you think about it and if you try this look and let me know the outcome in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching and if you've not subscribed, please subscribe. Bye bye. See you in my next one. Love you.